Hello, Steve Mills here. Uh, thank you for watching this video. This video is all about the results program. This is a program that I've spent 25 years, quarter of a century, um, developing. And it's a program uh, all about how you can improve your business results. And uh, I've spent this time uh, working and researching and getting a better understanding of the sales and marketing side of business. And I've literally invested over 20,000 hours and tens of thousands of pounds um, learning from some of the world's leading, in fact, many of the world's leading sales, marketing and business growth experts. I've taken that knowledge, I've honed it down to the best stuff I can find and I've turned it into a program for small businesses. Now that program is available as a, uh, an online program, as part of a group working with me in a small group, six, seven people on a weekly basis. And it's also available working with me as a consultant advising you on a one-to-one -one basis. Now, this is the, what, the fifth of the videos that I've produced. Uh, the results program is a seven module program uh, based on the letters results. So R-E-S-U, and this one is about L. Guess what L is? You're right. It's about lead generation, my favorite subject. And so it's about not only lead generation, but really it's about the improvement of lead generation, which is a key part of improving your results. You know, at the end of the day, you know, if you want to grow your business, grow the number of leads. That would be really key. Obviously, the conversion rate of those leads into sales is absolutely paramount as well. And we cover that in the sales mastery unit. So leads, right? Um, Firstly, it's about understanding what you're doing. And then, secondly, it's about how do we improve the effectiveness of what you're doing? Because one of my famous statements, if you will, is this. It's not that you're doing the wrong marketing. It's far more likely that you're doing the right marketing in the wrong way. All the time I hear people saying to me things like, well, I tried email marketing and that doesn't work anymore, Steve. And, you know, Google Pay Per Click just cost me a lot of money. Um, I'm on LinkedIn. I don't really do very much and I don't really win any business. And uh, we tried exhibiting. We went to a couple of exhibitions last year and, and didn't really do any good. You know, it just cost us a load of money. Now, if any of that rings any bells, then the answer is, well, why? Why is it that if you go to an exhibition, other people are winning business? That's why the exhibiting industry still survives to this day. Um, and you're not. Well, it's because you did the right marketing, i.e. exhibitions. But for some reason, you got it wrong. You didn't quite do it right. And it's very easy in marketing to do it wrong. If you're doing email marketing, perhaps you're using you know, a system like HubSpot or um, uh, Infusionsoft or one of the sort of cheaper end uh, systems. And uh, the point being, you know, whatever system you're using, if you're not winning business from it, then why not? There's always a reason because believe me, email marketing works fantastically well. Uh, not all the time. Sometimes people don't do it well. So um, I'm going to give you, if I may, a, a demo of this. This is a demonstration. And if you took any element of your marketing, there'd be a, a demonstration, a video within the results program helping you to improve the effectiveness of it. So I'm going to use email, if I may. Uh, so let's assume that you're doing email. So how can you improve it? You're getting a result, and that could be anything from no leads to very few leads. Or perhaps it's working really well. You're getting loads of leads. And you just want to get it to the next level. So first thing I'd look at is um, who's on the list. You know, that's really important. You have the best email, best written email. If it's not going out to enough people or the right people uh, or frequently enough, then 
you know, you're not going to get the best result. So we need to think about this database. You know, if 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 I win a hundred thousand uh, pounds per year from email marketing, and I've got a database of a thousand people, if I manage to double the size of my database, potentially that could go to two hundred thousand. Might not happen automatically overnight, but in theory that would definitely create an additional significant income. So, you know, increasing your database would be a really uh, relevant and effective way of doing that. Um, the other is perhaps maybe looking at that database and becoming better at segmenting it so that rather than, you know, sending an email out to everybody, which is a generalized email, we can segment it into industries and types and sizes of business and people who've said they're interested in this or that and so on and so forth. So that might be something. We then come to the actual email and uh, how do we improve the email itself. Well, the first place I'd go is the headline. There's an old saying in advertising that the headline is the advert for the advert. And so it is with email. So the headline is the advert for the email. So uh, without a good headline, you're probably not even going to get your email opened or, or read. So um, get the headline sorted. Uh, we then look at the first thing, the subheads, you know, the first impression, the first sentence. Um, we could look at the use of video, adding a video to that email. That might help you improve the performance of the email. Uh, we could look at the bullets and trying to change or improve those. We could perhaps add testimonials to that video so that, you know, it's not just you saying how great you are, but you've got loads of prospects and, and clients saying how great you are too. Uh, it could be that you improve the sales conversion, you know, the call to action uh, on the video, uh, sorry, on the email. Um, and now what tends to happen is that call to action is right down the bottom. You know, at the end, if you want to find out more, you know, email me on this or email me back here or fill in this form or whatever, you know, perhaps bringing it to the top um, might be something that improves performance. What about adding something free? Uh, here's my free report. Here's a free video for you. Here's a free uh, uh, meeting. You know, sign up. Here's a free webinar that you can attend before you ever buy so you can see whether this is any good and is right for you before you ever ask for any money. So you get the idea? And they're just, I don't know, Half a dozen, or probably more than that, probably a dozen ideas there that you could use to improve your email. And with the, the program, the results programs, got that across the board, whether that's improving your Facebook advertising, your website, uh, your blogging, your video, your, you know, your anything. So if you want to uh, find out more about the program or you want to sign up to the program, Remember, you've got three options, um, results online, be part of a small group, or one-to-one -one with me. Uh, if you want to sign up, go to the website. If you want a meeting to talk about signing up and finding out more, uh, very happy to do that. Uh, I'm not a pushy sales guy. Uh, I'm going to just explain, and you can make an informed decision as to whether this is for you. So that's it. Thank you ever so much for listening. Um, uh, if you want to uh, go to the website, it's probably the best way of getting in touch with me. Uh, simply go to www.stevemills.co. That's .co. Uh, thanks very much for listening and speak to you soon. Bye.